fist bump. We're into the game. Uh, we're into the game. Nice. Alright. Pokemon Stadium 1, uh, yeah, always a neutral map. No one's necessarily, I mean, uh, Little Mac always likes to be on the closest thing to FD possible, but, uh, honestly, a good Little Mac can use his platforms. Alright, forward air. Okay, Fallen definitely doing a good job of staying on the stage, not letting Di Diaper Nug pressure him off. Alright, yeah, nice Joel Haymaker, get him off. Vibe check? His vibes were not checked this day. Alright, down tilt into up tilt, trading with the down air. Alright, be careful of that dancing blade, just jolts Haymakers straight over it. Gets clipped by that up B. Oh. Yeah, jumping out of that down tilt is what you should do, because Colin's waiting to see how you react to that down tilt, and then he's gonna unleash the KO, so always jump out of that, do not spot dodge, or air dodge rather. All right, nice air dodge to ledge, though, from Colin. All right, but he's going to be thrown back off stage for that get-up attack. Side B. All right, Dipe be off stage now. Yeah, and, and Diaper Nug should not be... I, I mean, he sh might want to go off sometimes, but you got to be careful because you are giving up stage control when you go off and, and whiff off the ledge. And Little Mac, with his Jolt Haymaker, is a pretty safe option. Uh, he, he's pretty good at recovering high. Uh, that, that's kind of his whole point. So you gotta be definitely careful going off. You can't just blindly swing like that, but there we go. The up B on return is going to connect Colin. He's not gonna get that tech. Alright, oh, that interrupts that down smash with the, uh, Nair. Gets the down tilt. No jolt Haymaker afterward, though. Thrown off stage. Alright, ledge chumps. That's a re-grab. Oh! That was definitely weird. Colin was trying to see if he could drink something out there. All right, yeah, the up smash is gonna be reaching above that platform, and that shield is starting to look, starting to look scary. Colin's definitely gonna be pulling on the pressure right now. All right, off stage, no vibe check. All right, nice up B. Not gonna take it, but it's good damage. Vipernut can just get a little more damage before losing the stock. He's still in this game, and oh, he caught the jump? That's a dead mag. Very, very clean edge guard. That's what you need to do. Just catch their second jump. There's nothing they can do after that. All right. I like the... Oh, that's a playmaker. I like the fall-through platform up airs. That covers so much space for Lucina uh, and Roy and really anyone with a sword, except for Ike. Ike's up air is too slow. All right, yeah, there you go. The fall through platform up air is so good. All right, oh, the J Jolt Haymaker. He's expecting a tech in place there. Oh, but the tech straight into the jab. Don't come near me, bro. You thought you were getting a check chase? Take these fists. Ooh. All right, yeah, Dipey's still kind of... There we go, taking center stage. He's just kind of staying on the ledge, uh, playing on the ledge a bit too much, kind of retreating too much. You can't let... Little Mac have center stage. You want to be pressuring him off. And oh, just the run up KO to finish off the first game. Let's go. Can we get some hit him Max in chat? Let's go. It's going to be game one. Oh, whoops. I had Diaper Nug having one uh, score there. He did not have one score last game. That was game one. All right, cool. Aw, oh, Zeep Sandfloor. Thank you so much. <laughs> that actually means a lot to me. Wow. Um, Alright, the skin switch on Lucina, though. I, I, I think that was a different skin than he was using before. Maybe not. Maybe I'm crazy. Maybe I'm crazy. Alright, but Colin sticking with the little Mac. The golden Mac. He is the golden boy. We're into this game, too. That's back loops. There you go. Uh, there you go. And, uh... What? Still backwards. There we go. No. Things are getting messed up on stream. I'm going crazy. Don't listen to me. Alright, Town and City. Uh, it's... It, in theory, it's a good... Oh, whoa! Whoa! How'd that send him off stage? That was crazy. Uh, good on Colin reacting to that, getting back on stage. Uh, but as for this map... I mean, 
I could definitely see why you think it's bad for Little Mac. You know, you got these big high platforms you can kind of camp on, um, all that kind of fun stuff. But at this moment right now, where it's just FD, that's where Little Mac shines if you don't have any projectiles. So for a Swords character like Lucina or uh, a brawler like Mario or something, uh, Little Mac can kind of excel on Town and City. You know, this is pretty much just Kalos, Final Destination, and then you have that other transformation, which is just one transformation of the three that, that's really that great. But, you know, it could also just be a comfort pick. Uh, I like Town and City. I don't necessarily think about matchups. When Oh, wow, going super far off using that side plat. That's exactly why Diaper Nug wanted to come here. So use those side platforms, be able to go off higher, punish those high recoveries. You also have to remember that those side platforms are going to help Little Mac re uh, recover as well, though, and definitely adapt to that. All right, I mean, catching him in the... Oh, nice dancing blades. Oh, and landing with the counter. Yeah, if Colin lands in front of you, he's probably going to counter... Ooh! Might as well get that damage. He was dead anyway. All right, Diaper Nug at nice percent right now. And Colin, oh, forward smash. Almost evens up the stocks right there. No vibe check. All right, Diaper Nug trying to space out these fares. Colin just running in, doing little Mac things. I think he just hit him with an aerial right there. Oh, caught the jump, be careful. That's a dead Mac, GG. G, G to that, sir. And here we are in a game three situation. Let's see where Colin's gonna go. Imagine it'll be FD, maybe, uh, maybe Yoshi's Island. Yeah, Yoshi's Island, there it is. Yoshi's Island, you it, you have an easier time getting those two frames, getting those vibe checks that uh, Little Mac's always looking for when his opponents are off stage. That's that's Little Mac's edge guarding. Is just trying to two frame with the down smash. <laughs> it's all or nothing. You either get it or you don't. All right. And diaper nug spacing out these short hops. Trying to make some magic happen, but oh wow, Colin coming in. Diaper Nug already at 53%. Oh, and that Joel Haymaker sends him back off stage, going for the vibe check. Oh, a bit too early. Alright, oh, just a raw forward smash. On the shield. Gets barely clipped by that. KO punch is online. You gotta be careful. He will shark you from under there with the KO punch. I'm not sure how it works on Yoshi's island completely, but I think you'll still die. I think it'll still reach and you'll still die. All right, careful. Oh, bad KO punch, still makes it back. Oh, but that neutral get up, Diaper Nug getting that, that few, I don't know how many frames it is. There's a few frames when with a neutral get up where you're vulnerable uh, and can't shield yet. All right, oh, that was some weird, that was a weird dash. Colin right there. All right, Colin back off stage. Oh, and super armors through the Dancing Blades with that forward smash, taking the first stock. Basically an even game. I mean, Little Mac, he can... He'll have you at 40 in an instant. All right? <laughs> that forward smash almost already had Diaper Nug at 40 right there. All right, yeah. And you see Colin with that down tilt. He's waiting for the air dodge. It's always good to jump out of Colin's down tilts, or any Little Mac's down tilts for that matter. All right, a whiffed KO. That KO seriously sends Little Mac flying horizontally. All right, both hits of Nair. Be careful. All right, forward tail. He's just punching across the stage. All right, bad get up attack. He's back off stage and oh, it caught his jump. Even if that didn't kill him right off the bat, there's no way he was making that back. That's the point where you don't even DI. It's like, whatever, just die. Oh, nice uh, super armor forward smash. And the forward tilt sending Diaper Nug back off stage. No vibe check. Get up attack. Into the Dancing Blades to call out the tech. Dancing Blades is so good for tech chases. Oh, forward tilt, not gonna take it though. Vibe check? No. 
Oh, down air? I'm surprised there was not an up smash after that. That was that was perfect up smash space. KO Punch is online, and KO Punch is offline. Oh, Colin. Oh, back air. That was hard fight. Colin lived a lot longer than any other little Mac would have right there, though. I gotta say, very good game to Diaper Nug. Very well done. Fun match. Fun set to watch, for sure.